The number one cancer killer in the U.S. is lung cancer. Every two and a half minutes, someone in the U.S. learns that they have lung cancer. In 2014, the American Lung Association decided enough was enough, and Lung Force was born. And CBS Health was there with us every step of the way, walking alongside survivors at Lung Force Walks, supporting new endeavors like our Lung Force Expos, Galas, Advocacy Day, awareness campaigns, and our State of Lung Cancer Report, and raising funds every year to help us grow our mission. CVS Health has gone even further. A surprising move by the pharmacy chain CVS it just announced it will no longer sell cigarettes and tobacco products in, st in stores nationwide. So this morning, CVS breaking the mold and setting the standard. My mother-in-law died from lung cancer in 2011. In her memory, we volunteer at our local lung course walk every year. I've been working for CVS Health for 12 years now, working from a cashier up to a shift supervisor. And I'm so proud to be a part of an organization that gives back. Because of CVS Health's support, we have been able to increase our annual investment in lung cancer research by over 200%, totaling over 12.5 million since 2014. Support more than 86,000 patients and caregivers with health education online resources. Empower 245,000 Americans to learn if they were at high risk for lung cancer and help secure a 69% increase in NIH lung cancer research funding through our annual Advocacy Day, where lung force heroes from all 50 states convene on Washington, D.C. to make their voices heard. But even heroes need a champion to take their individual voices and lift them up to create a national movement. Thank you, CVS Health, for being our champion and lung force hero.